The year was 1964. It was a time of love. I took a job far away, and your mother roped to me every day. We had plans of starting a life together, but tragedy struck and changed everything that year. Help! Beth. He's gone, Beth. It's a miracle you're here. I never told you this story. Do you remember that old tree? <laughs> yes, I, I remember the tree. <laughs> I want you to put my ashes there. Don't talk like that. You're gonna be fine. You made me get food all over Grandma's urn. I don't know why you insist on eating with that thing. You know she goes wherever I go. Dad. Yeah? I think we should take Grandma's urn to the tree and bury her ashes there. Yeah, but Grandpa doesn't remember exactly where the tree is anymore. Wait. I have Grandma and Grandpa's letters. The tree has to be mentioned in here somewhere. That's what we should do. Drive out the Two River and bury Grandma. Mama and Seth, be real quiet. Ba -da -da -ba. Uh. Ba -da -da -ba. Ah! Uh. Where are we? Something's wrong with the camper. I'm looking for a place to stop. A gas station or something. But we're in the middle of nowhere. Daddy dropped the keys down that old well up there. Drop the keys to the camper down that well. You can lower me down there and I can grab the keys. You know, she hardly weighs anything. Have you lost your mind? Looks like we got Shh, company. Super secret mission. Shh. Super secret mission. Howdy, folks. Hi. What are we all doing out here? Uh, we just had a little, uh, little engine trouble, you know. Eddie, you know why I'm so rough on you. Oh, why is that? You're not close to the Lord. That's the problem with your generation. My generation. Why are we going to the tree to bury Grandma? The road's blocked, Pumpkin. Eddie, uh, take me to that church. 